Hi everyone, welcome to Filmstorm Studios and today I'm using a fan question that I've had asked quite a lot and how to change a float to a string value. So you'll notice that in our FSM here on our cube we have a float that is set at 100 and it's counting down every frame. But how do you link that up to this, um, this UI system, this canvas? So this is what we're going to answer in this tutorial. So if you go to your canvas, um, just create a new FSM, and we're going to call this float to int to string. Now, what we want to do is we want to create three variables. You want to create a float, a integer, which is a this integer, which is a full number, so it's rounded to the nearest um, decimal point or just to a, a straight number. And then we're also going to want to create a string. A string is what can be displayed by a UI system. Alrighty, so let's go to our state and I'm going to say get FSM float and that's going to get this cubes FSM, which is, has the countdown float happening. And we're going to say get that every frame. And then we're going to say convert the float to an integer. So we're going to say float to integer. We're going to round it to the nearest and say every frame. And then we're going to say uh, we don't need that action. We're going to get, go to the text. Make sure that this lock is clicked um, on gray, which means that when you click around, it's not going to turn off the FSM. Go to text, um, make sure this is on, and then drag in the script this text script, say set property, go down to text and then just click this and then say set as string, say every frame. Now we need one more step so go back to the action browser and say integer to string, convert integer to string and then we're going to say convert the int to the string and say that do that every frame and then prop that down so it's going to go, it's going to get the FSM from the cube it's going to convert the float into an integer and then the integer into a string which can then be displayed and we're setting the property of the text to this string. Alrighty, and now if you press play, you'll notice that it's properly counting down. Alrighty, thanks for watching guys. Hope that answers everyone's questions. Um, if you have any more questions, leave them in the comments below and I'll answer them for you. Um, for now, it's been Kiran Sapien for Filmstorm Studios and I'll see you next time.